For the Ghana people as for all Aboriginal people, every part of our country is important. The Ghana people believe some very important places have been made or visited by great spirit heroes during the dreaming when the land was transformed and life began. One account told of the hero Chubuki. Chubuki emerged from the ground near a mountain in the south. He heard that his sister's son further north was dead. When he found the body, he learned that the boy had died because he killed an emu which was forbidden. Chibuki returned to place the body in a cave near a swampy lagoon. At each place he rested on the way, his tears of grief turned into springs of water. He left the cave through a crevice at the back and was transformed into an ibis. For the Ghana people, the springs linked them to the spirit world, which was the basis of their life. This is why water conservation is important to us at Ghana Plain School, and we chose the problem of the spilt water. When we were using the taps to get water, we noticed that it spilled everywhere. We always have a lot of fun playing with the water in our sandpit and wanted to use the water responsibly in our wetlands too. We looked at the history of how our mob collected water and carried it around. We learnt about the Kulaman and how this was technology that Ghana and Aboriginal people used for centuries to collect water. We got into groups and brainstormed ideas on how we could fix the problem of the spilt water. Then we chose the best solution to the problem. Our idea is to use Maker's Empire to design a funnel to help collect water from the taps. So we were out what design features we would need. We decided it needed to be 30 centimetres wide to catch all the water out of the tap. Not enough to be easy to use. No more than 3 centimetres for the fit on top of the bucket and under the tap. We first made our prototype to understand our design using cardboard and tape. We practiced using Maker's Empire to come up with our designs. We discussed and shared the design with each other. After looking at the design Auntie Louise made, we realised that we needed to make our design a whole lot bigger. We know that the final stage is testing but we don't have a 3D printer at our school. Improve on our designs. Design glitches. Teaching new skills to others. That failure is part of the process. How to use Maker's Empire. How to solve problems. Testing our ideas. To give feedback.